What's up everybody, it's your One Bad Drifter here. I want to show you how to install Google XC. Some people have been is having issues and I've seen it on YouTube and maybe people have different ideas and I think that mine can be at least, uh, some give you a rough idea. I might not say that it's, it's the best idea but you can check it out. And uh, some people have reported that they had a problem with uh, communication and server problem, maybe. So please my like my page and comment and it's good to share ideas. So first thing you have to go to Google. Yeah. Go to Gog website, Gog Galaxy. Type in there, Gog Galaxy. Down. Then... Search for it. it. There it is. There's a link. It leads you to Go Galaxy website, and you can see there's a lot of stuff, uh, games. You can do anything here. You can you can chat with play gamers around the world and just share ideas, share moments with your gaming. Okay, you can download the Go Galaxy here. 2.0 that's the latest version you can download it with IDM or any other thing that you have any downloader after that you can open the folder and uh, check it if it's downloaded this is here I had already downloaded the version of it then uh, refresh and just open one and to install so I know that the installation takes too long but I have to fast forward the video a bit so in a moment let's just wait and see people have been having issues with it so mine is just to say that it has to deal with the DLL files because gog.exe sometimes when it installs the DLL files you know, are sometimes missing or maybe misplaced so you can try to log in or just uh, connect to the internet and it fails when it comes up with a different um, different error message yeah so i'll show you how this thing works out sometimes and it's for my own op opinion let's say uh, let's click it it's already downloaded open it you b and there's the you see that mcvcp 140.dll and vc runtime dot dll files so what you have to do is go and type open dll dot com i'll leave the link in the description i just up right open dll and it will go to, it will lead you to its website we'll get there then type the two dll files that are missing these are the one mc mc msvcp 140.dll search for it and uh, make sure it's a 32-bit because gog.exe is a 32-bit uh, setup so you can download it and uh, just wait a while these are just small files no, they're not that big yeah so install downloading it is just an ease and just Download the other one. You see, this has MCVSP, the one for the other. You have to copy it first, put it in a new folder in the desktop or wherever you want to put it, paste it there, then close. Go to Google again and type there another VC runtime 140.dll as highlighted there. Okay, and search for it and get the 32 bit leave the 64 bit alone and download it again so it's just easy like this so it doesn't have to be a big deal about it so you download the other one open the folder then copy it on new folder first extract or copy it yeah in the new folder paste it there okay we have the two files so we need to extract them 
so that we remain with the only DLL. So let's abstract it here. Yes to all. Then we get the. We, did, we removed all the archives that we don't need. We remain with the DLL files here. The two of them. So first of all, you have to go close this first. Go to gog.exe. Open file location. It's in the program files uh, 86 x86 that two bit. So copy the two DLL files there. Continue there and uh, open the program data file. Sometimes you have to put the folder to show the folder hidden folder so you can see it. So it's hidden in the program files. Go there inside and copy the the two files. So make sure you have to place the folder option hidden folders on to see them. Okay, let's test it. Uh, now should work. It's just simple as that. So let's see how it works out. Open it. I believe this the Dog Galaxy servers are okay. So let's just see if uh, yeah, it's working. So you can put your email and Gmail. Sorry for the blur. I have to put my, my details there for privacy. Sometimes they, you should be prompted to check your email address and they give you a four digit code. And boom, that's it. That's it, it's working. So you can check it out and see everything is cool. And on my on on my on my opinion I just wanted to download go because I like playing a few games not that much, but I had to play Gwent and it's really a good game, so I had to see how it works. So you can like my video, you can share, and I'm happy to hear from you. It's a new channel, and it's uh, for gaming, and also for software solutions and difficulties. And I hope that we should keep in touch. So peace, everybody. Check it out.